All right, what up, y'all? I have a great tip for you today. If you're rebuilding the diesel engine in your tractor, check it out. All right, so here's the tool right here, guys. This is a tapered piston ring compression tool. And don't click off just yet, guys. Don't do it. Wait till the end. It gets better. Um, so I know a lot of you guys know what this is, but it gets better when you're working on these diesel engines. The thing that I found out the hard way. So this is 90 millimeter bore on the bottom, matches up with the sleeve, 90 millimeters right down in there. And then at the top, it's bigger. So it's like a V, right? Um, that's gonna come into handy here in a second. I'm gonna show you why. Everyone knows about these type uh, compression tools. They will break your rings when you are working on a diesel engine or a tractor. They will mess up your stuff. And then you're gonna have to order a new set of rings for 80 bucks. Ask me how I know. All right, so here's the diesel engine rings on the left. And here's some gasoline engine rings on the right. And you can see the difference. This is off a smaller engine. But either way, look how thick these things are. They're like an eighth of an inch thick. So if you try to use that standard ring compressor, you will break them and you'll have to buy new ones. And uh, you know this is working at 150 PSI and this is working at 650 PSI. So that's the main difference between the tools. Use the tapered one so that you don't break these rings because they are not cheap. Get a pair of these piston ring expander pliers too. It'll help so that you don't break these thick old rings. I'll put links to every tool that I use in this video in the description. Let's see that compressor tool in action. Compressor. Oil. Old broken piston with the rings on here. I know it's missing the bottom one, but you'll get the idea. In. Man, that thing went right in there, easy peasy. You know how hard it was to try to compress it with this? That thing just slid right in there with those eighth inch uh, rings, those thick old diesel rings that slid right in there and we didn't break a single thing. So now it's time to do the real deal. Y'all have to check out that video up here later. Peace.